good morning and welcome back to the channel and so today we're having some coffee and a little chat and so I'm sharing this across all three channels um, my name is Lisa in case you're new I'm I am the owner of Grey Wolf at Dormants I also founded the Day Hacker Grammy channel and the May, My Pig and Pathwork channels. Um, so I'm spreading this all across all three channels. And I wanted to come on today and give you guys an update and let you know what's been going on. Um, so I, I am a, one of those people that um, didn't feel super duper comfortable um, getting the vaccines and and um, so I am not I am one of the unvaccinated and unfortunately um, I did get COVID-19 and I was pretty sick for a couple of weeks um, two days after I got COVID-19 um, my mother also um, got COVID-19 and she is in her 70s and as a result she she has struggled with it a lot more than I have she is still trying to kick it as we speak and um, in mid-August um, so um, I can, I can tell you from watching from watching her struggle and going through the struggles that I've had since April really uh, April is when I had my major surgery and so much has happened that it it's really it's really changed my perspective uh, on a lot of different things but this last bout with covid has has been more 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 so than anything else um just the whole chain of events i mean life is it, it it's just it's uncanny how how much i have learned through this this experience that it, it it's just being that ill and it potentially life-threatening it's a, it changes your perspective on things really and what's what's important changes and the first the first time I I filmed this it, it it was just a little bit a little bit too dark and and I don't really want it to be I don't want it to be that dark because uh, honestly, I, I, I've, I've spent this time since since April figuring out what I don't want for my life and and then when I got COVID it it changed things even further and it was a reminder from the universe not to be complacent and um it, it's easy to just go back to old habits because they feel comfortable and and they're they're the known things and so it I need to make some changes and I wanted to, I want to talk to you about a couple of people that have been an inspiration to me and the first of those people is is Jessica Sowards from Roots and Refuge Farm um, I have left the links to her channel um, in in the in the description box below and I have been watching Jessica Sowards for a while now she has she has uh, that whole family uh, it's Jessica and Jeremiah Sowards and their family, and it's about their homesteading experience. I have learned so much about gardening from Jessica that 
that, um, which is why I started watching her is because as she has um, some gardening tips. But their channel is about homesteading. And recently they have branched out and instead of doing just YouTube, they now have their own documentary series on the Abundance Plus streaming network. And she was talking about their journey uh, and why they decided to do this documentary series on, on Abundance Plus. And the thing, one of the things that stood out to me when she was talking about this is that um, it made all the difference in the world um, to her channel. And it, it, when she started treating YouTube like her job. And and it, and it does make a difference t to me, I, th I think, as well. Um, it's a level of commitment um, that that makes the difference, that it makes all the difference. And, and so just her, just her talking about how they, how they came to this place in time where they're at right now. Um, right now they're in the, pro they, they just moved their farm from Arkansas to South Carolina. And so it's been amazing watching this family evolve on YouTube and, um, watching them premiere their, um, Wilder Still documentary. It's just, it's just been an amazing journey watching them. So I've been very inspired by them. The other person that has inspired me lately is his, his name is Don Yarbrough. He's the founder of Wild Workers of America. Hopefully I'm saying that right. Um, I don't, I'm not really sure how to pronounce it, but I've left that link in the description box below. And one of the things that inspires me about Don is he started a, a, a very grassroots movement in Wild Workers of America. Well, Wild Workers of Lamar County actually is what it is. And he's based out of Paris, Texas. And he and his volunteers have made it their mission in life to clean up Paris. It, they go out and they collect trash. Um, this gentleman started this group. He has been instrumental in getting their nonprofit status and they are a legitimate organization. And I, I am I am inspired by this because Don is very passionate about what he does. And so for me, coming out the other side of of major illnesses, coming out the other side of depression, of all of my shadow work, in, in some events that have happened at work lately, you know, I have spent the last few months figuring out what I don't want to do and what I don't want for my life. And now it's time for me to figure out what I do want. And I know for certain that I want to make an impact. I want to make a difference. I do not want to spend the rest of my life being a barista. Um, um, the job is making me extremely unhappy right now. It The, the schedule is crazy. Um, it's there. There's no set. It does not allow me to set a routine um, because my days off change, my schedule changes. I don't have set hours. It's it it's just a complete hodgepodge. And so, coming out the other side of a major illness again, it, it was like a reminder from the universe: don't get complacent and. What I was supposed to be doing post-surgery and 
I just got away from it all. And so now I'm, I'm making some changes. The, the first thing I'm going to try to do is, is find a different job. Um, I need a set schedule. So I am trying to go back to work in an office where I can work Monday through Friday and have set hours. And, and I think that will allow me to focus and make a commitment and treat YouTube like my job and help me um, get the tools that I need and, and just give me a set schedule and so I can be more regular about uploading content. So that's the first thing that I'm looking for is that I'm, I'm trying to change change my day job. Um, the next thing that I'm going to do is consolidate my channels. Instead of having three, three channels, I am just going to have one channel. And having one channel, I can focus on the content for that channel. And I am going to place all of my efforts into my Grey Wolf Adornments channel. And um, so when I when I started my day hacker Grammy channel, it was about hiking and camping and traveling. And unfortunately I can't do any of it. well, I can still go hiking and in camping, but it's just not it's not where my focus is lying right now, so I'm going to discontinue that channel and not, not try to focus, not try to share content. And so my Pagan Pathworks, I started that to share uh, the life lessons and stuff that I was learning. Um, but my spirituality is just it it's it's such an evolving an evolving thing and it overlaps my other mission in life and my mission in life is to help people change their habits so they're not only environmentally friendly they're healthier and so I am go uh, I'm going to focus all of my efforts on my Grey Wolf Adornments channel and I'm going to rename it um, and, and I, basically I'm going to turn that into a lifestyle channel and I'm going to share all of my content on that single channel so I can focus on on and make a commitment to growing that one single avenue and, and and make that my job and so I can focus on that single channel. So I hope that you guys will stick with me. I've left all the links below if you're watching from my Day Hacker Grammy or my Pagan Pod Works. I have left the link to um, the other YouTube channel in the in the description box. I hope you guys will stick with me. I, I hope this hasn't been too rambly and boring this morning. And I thank you so much for your time and attention. And I'll see you next time.